We're now on our conversation with the new CBS Mornings anchor, Nate Burleson. He did spend three years here in Minnesota wearing that Vikings jersey. Next week, Nate joins Gail King and Tony DeCopel on the National News Desk right after our show. CBS Mornings will be live every morning from their new set in Times Square. We talk with Nate about race and about being a role model during times like these. Here in, in Minnesota, especially over the last uh, year, year and a half, there's been quite a focus on race and race relations in our community. Uh, and it's not lost on me how meaningful it is to have a relatively young black man uh, as the anchor of this flagship morning show right here on WCCO and CBS. It's a big deal. It really is a big deal. And I am in a privileged position which uh, means there is an obligation and a responsibility um, for not only um, me to represent as a former athlete, um, but a young African-American man in this seat. Um, and I'm thankful for that. This right here is, is prime real estate in the TV world, as you guys know. So being thankful for that, knowing that it is an honor, I'm going to wake up every day, um, not just work hard and approach my job with passion, um, but I'm also going to earn the love and trust of the viewers as we do what we need to do uh, to give them exactly what they need. Um, everything from the very light end of the spectrum to what we've been doing the last couple of days in handling Hurricane Ida. So um, th this is a, a great position for me to be in and I'm only following um, the blueprint of African-American men and women that have come before me and hopefully raising the bar for those to come after me. And Nate, you were a Minnesotan for at least a few years here. Any special message for our Minnesota viewers here? Oh, first, let me say Skull Vikes to all the Vikings fans. Um, I spent three years in Minnesota. Big piece of my heart is left there. Um, I just want to say thank you because even though I've played for a few different teams, I've moved around and went from city to city, those Vikings fans have stayed loyal and true. So from Nate Burleson to you all, thank you so much. And then shout out to my brother Kevin Burleson, who is on the staff of the Minnesota Timberwolves. I'm going to be cheering them on this season as well. So hopefully we can get Nate right, here Jason. for a game, Heather, to, yeah. to a Timberwolves game to see his brother in action too. Oh, my gosh, that would be fantastic. Yeah. Uh, I have to ask, though, I mean, what other morning show across the country is welcoming Nate with cows like Dorito <laughs> right here? <laughs>